Good afternoon, brothers and sisters. Let us pray the Holy Rosary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of thy love. Send forth thy Spirit, and they shall be created. And thou shalt renew the face of the earth. O most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, and Mother of the Church, we... With joy, and wonder. With joy and wonder, we seek to make our own your Magnificat, joining you in your hymn of thankfulness and love. Seek to aid us, dear Mother, for the sick, penitents, and those who ask for your motherly help, especially those who are in agony and are to die today. Amen. 
I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there He will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, for an increase of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on five joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O, o my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins. Save, save us from the fires of hell, and, and lead all souls into heaven, heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O, o my, my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins. Save, save us from, from the fires of hell, hell. And lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. The third joyful mystery is the birth of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O, o my, my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins. sins. Save, Save us from the fires of hell. And, and lead all souls into heaven, heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. mercy. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God. Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my, my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins. sins. Save, Save us from, from the fires, fires of hell. hell. And lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses 
as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O, o my, my Jesus, Jesus, forgive us our sins, sins. Save, save us from the fires of hell, hell. and lead all souls, souls into heaven, heaven especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy. Hail, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you do we sense up our sights, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, the nice of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, the litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. For us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of the Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother of the Church, pray for us. Mother of Mercy, pray for us. Mother of Hope, pray for us. Mother most pure, pray for us. Mother most chaste, pray for us. Mother inviolate, pray for us. Mother undefiled, pray for us. Mother most amiable, pray for us. Mother most admirable, pray for us. Mother of good counsel, pray for us. Mother of our Creator. Pray for us. Mother of our Savior, pray for us. Virgin most prudent, pray for us. Virgin most venerable, pray for us. Virgin most renowned, pray for us. Virgin most powerful, pray for us. Virgin most merciful, pray for us. Virgin most faithful, pray for us. Mirror of justice, pray for us. Seat of wisdom, pray for us. Cause of our joy, pray for us. Spiritual vessel.
vessel, pray for us. vessel of honor, pray for us. singular vessel of devotion, pray for us. mystical rose, pray for us. tower of David, pray for us. tower of ivory, pray for us. house of gold, pray for us. ark of the covenant, pray for us. gate of heaven, pray for us. morning star, pray for us. health of the sick, pray for us. refuge of sinners, pray for us. solace of migrants, pray for us. Comforter of the afflicted, pray for us. Help of Christians, pray for us. Queen of angels, pray for us. Queen of patriarchs, pray for us. Queen of prophets, pray for us. Queen of apostles, pray for us. Queen of martyrs, pray for us. Queen of confessors, pray for us. Queen of virgins, pray for us. Queen of all saints, pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin, pray for us. Queen taken up into heaven. Pray for us. Queen of the Holy Rosary. Pray for us. Queen of families. Pray for us. Queen of peace. Pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech Thee, that while meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise to the same Christ our Lord. Amen. The Memorare. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession, was left unaided. Inspired with this confidence, I fly unto thee, O Virgin of virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful, O Mother of the Word incarnate. Despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy, hear and answer me. Amen. Prayer to Saint Michael. Saint Michael, the archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan, and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. For the intentions of the Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us. Amen. And may the souls of the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. May the blessings of the Almighty God, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit be with us always. Amen. Mary, cause of our joy. Pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
Good afternoon, dear brothers and sisters, marriage band. Si Dominic Sebastian, anak ni na Danilo Pablo Sebastian at Lolita Pineda, na naninirahan sa Soldiers Hills Village, Butatan, Muntinlupa City, ay ikakasal kay Arian Rose Jocales, anak ni na Alex Jocales at Norma Galope, na naninirahan sa Barangay Canlalay City, of Binyan, Laguna. Si Balbino Coronado III, anak ni na Balbino Coronado Jr. at Magdalena Gantala, na naninirahan sa Mutual Home, Putatan, Muntinlupa City, ay ikakasal kay Aya Rose Rosete, anak ni na Ezequias Rosete at Ruth Magpantay, na naninirahan sa Santo Nino, Lumban, Laguna. Si Adrian Mark Reyes, anak ni na Rizaldo Reyes at Marian Blaser, na naninirahan sa Mutual Home Phase 1 and 2, Putatan, Muntinlupa City, ay ikakasal kay Zarina Francois Sibayan, anak ni na Rolando Sibayan at Maria Teresa Bersamina, na naninirahan sa Mutual Home Phase 1 and 2, Putatan, Muntinlupa City. Ang sino man ang may alam na hadlang o tutol sa nabanggit ng mga ikakasal ay mangyari lamang makipagkita o tumawag sa ating parish office sa numero 7340-0900. Salamat po. Let us include in our prayer the intentions and petitions offered in today's Mass. May the Lord accept and be pleased with the thanksgiving intentions of Betty O'Darve and family, Rogelio Tulang and family, Gilor Eleazar and family, Mr. and Mrs. Asilio Namit and family, Maricar Cuevas and family, Miguel Zaira Custodio, Marikina family, Nympha Marshall Eascobia and family, Elvira Lagutiman. May the Lord grant material and spiritual blessings to all those who are celebrating their birthdays today, especially Crystal Bien, Zenaida Arcilia Manresa, Edita Blanco Factora. May the Lord strengthen the bond of love of all married couples, especially those who are celebrating their wedding anniversaries, namely, J. Mart Ramile and Dioan Calio. May the Lord touch and heal all those who are sick, especially Dijet Ambata, Olympia Balugay, Jose Pepe Victoria, Judge Grace Ruiz, Ana Biso, Nieve Celis, Joan Balite, Joel Jose, Henry Crisostomo, Beatriz Arciaga, George Manao, Elpidio Ebonia, Emelita Arceo, Gina Gamboa Apostol, Vanellope Ray Rongavilla, Jose Arnel Baza, Lilia Daguman, Florentina Coloma, Coloma Family, Caroline Manalili, Sarah Gatdula, Rolando Villar, Maynard, Eduarda Pastrana, Bagangan Family, Merle Borja, Amancio Bodarve, Rolly and Lolita Dalan, Catriona Mendoza, Catherine Mendoza, Kimberly Zari, Michael Jose, Godinez Family, Junita Dayao Gomez and Children, Marlon Vedar. May the Lord listen and respond to the personal intentions and petitions of Manny Salazar, Maricar Cuevas and family, Edna Gonzalez and family, Domingo family, Ronaldo Cruz and family, Amatong and Brehente family, Hannah Lorraine and Mary Christine Baral, Marikina family, 
Riza Calarde, Mark Lorenzo Eleazar, Nitz Carpio and Family, J.R. Mendoza, Tess Cancino and Family, King Maris Food Products, Nathaniel Nati, Joe Simon Victoria Ambata. We pray for the eternal repose of the souls of Jude Patrick Estalilia, Jefferson Ambata, Aquilina Victoria, Bonifacio Ramil, Simon Hernandez, Felipe Pikes Bundalian, Benedicto Roldan, Esperanza Babe Jose, Jasper Basco, Emmanuel, Rowena Pimentel, Telesforo Menor Jr., Silvestre Rivera, Lydia Valdez, Mariam Tarol Kapanindin, Rafael Pertes, Marcos Nuestro, Delphine Buenpipo, Jing Olivia, Rita Godinez, Michael Digal Ranoa, and all the souls in purgatory. Please kneel as we pray the Horatio Imperata for protection against COVID-19. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Merciful and compassionate Father, we come to you in our need to seek your protection against the COVID-19 virus that has disturbed and claimed many lives. We ask you now to look upon us with love, and by your healing hand, dispel the fear of sickness and death, restore our hope, and strengthen our faith. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. We thank you for the vaccines developed, made possible by your guiding hand. Bless our efforts to use this vaccine to end the pandemic in our country. We pray for our health workers that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. Grant them health in mind and body, strength in their commitment, protection from the disease. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in these trying times to work for the good of all and to help those in need. May our concern and compassion for each other see us through this crisis and lead us to conversion and holiness. Grant all this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. Our Lady, health of the sick, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel, pray for us. San Roque, pray for us. San Lorenzo Ruiz, pray for us. San Pedro Calunsod, pray for us. Mary, cause of our joy, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today is the 25th Sunday in Ordinary Time. Please stand as we begin the Eucharistic celebration. Sing a new song unto the Lord. Let your song be sung from mountain side. Sing a new song unto the Lord. Sing Alleluia. Yahweh's people dance for joy. O come before the Lord and play for Him the red tambourines and let your trumpet sound. Sing a new song unto the Lord. 
Let your song be sung from mountain side. Sing a new song unto the Lord. Sing a In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God the Father, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be always with you. And with your spirit. My dear friends, greetings, and welcome to our Eucharistic celebration. And today we celebrate the 25th Sunday in the Ordinary Time. We bring once again before the Lord all the intentions, of the parish together with your own personal prayers. But as we celebrate today's liturgy, we also pray for one another that we will heed the call of Jesus, and that is to serve, especially serving the least, the last, and the lost. To prepare now ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries, again, we acknowledge that we are sinners. We ask the Lord for mercy and for forgiveness. I confess to Amen. Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to God, glory to God in the highest. Glory to God, glory to God in the highest. And on earth each to people of goodwill. founded all the commands of your sacred law, 
upon love of you and of our neighbor, grant that by keeping your precepts, we may marry to attain eternal life. To our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the Book of Wisdom. The wicked say, Let us beset the just one, because he is obnoxious to us. He sets himself against our doings, reproaches us for transgressions of the law, and charges us with violations of our training. Let us see whether his words be true. Let us find out what will happen to him. For if the just one be the Son of God, God will defend him and deliver him from the hand of his foe. With revilement and torture, let us put the just one to the test, that we may have proof of his gentleness and try his patience. Let us condemn him to a shameful death, for according to his own words, God will take care of him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord upholds my life. The Lord upholds my life. O God, by your name save me, and by your might defend my cause. O God, hear my prayer. Hearken to the words of my mouth. The Lord upholds my life. For the haughty have risen up against me. The ruthless seek my life. They set not God before their eyes. The Lord upholds my life. Behold, God is my helper. The Lord sustains my life. Freely will I offer you sacrifice. I will praise your name, O Lord, for its goodness. The Lord upholds my life. A reading from the letter of St. James. Beloved, where jealousy and selfish ambition exist, there is disorder and every foul practice. But the wisdom from above is first of all pure, then peaceable, gentle, compliant, full of mercy and good fruit, without inconstancy or insincerity. And the fruit of righteousness is sown in peace for those who cultivate peace. Where do the wars and where do the conflicts among you come from? Is it not from your passions? that make war within your members? You covet, but do not possess. You kill and envy, but you cannot obtain. You fight and wage war. You do not possess because you do not ask. You ask, but do not receive, because you ask wrongly to spend it on your passion. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Alleluia. 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 God called us through the gospel to possess the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Alleluia.
And the Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus and his disciples left from there and began a journey through Galilee, but he did not wish anyone to know about it. He was teaching his disciples and telling them, The Son of Man is to be handed over to men, and they will kill him. And three days after his death, the Son of Man will rise. But they did not understand the saying, and they were afraid to question him. They came to Capernaum, and once inside the house, he began to ask them, What were you arguing about on the way? But they remained silent. They had been discussing among themselves on the way who was the greatest. Then he sat down, called the twelve, and said to them, If anyone wishes to be first, he shall be the last of all and the servant of all. Taking a child, he placed him in their midst, and putting his arms around it, he said to them, Whoever receives one child such as this in my name receives me, and anyone who receives me receives not me, but the one who sent me. My dear brothers and sisters, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. My dear brothers and sisters, again, thank you for joining us in once again offering this Holy Mass. And in this uh, Eucharist, we continue to place before the Lord all the prayers we have at the parish, but also your own personal prayers. Marami po tayong patuloy na ipinagdarasal, uh, lalong-lalo na po ang uh, mga may sakit sa ating parokya. And my dear friends, especially those uh, who were infected with the disease, uh, some of them are very dear to us, some of them are very close to us. So we continue to pray for their healing. And yet, uh, siguro, uh, we beg to uh, ask you to give us your understanding. Uh, siguro nalaman po ninyo na ang IATF, they already have allowed uh, churches to accept uh, people in coming to church in religious gatherings at least 10%. Pero ang parokya natin, we have decided na to do that yet. Uh, kasi kahit yung ating mga kabataan, even among young people, my dear friends, uh, marami po sa kanilang dinadapuan ng sakit sa COVID-19. So these coming days, uh, wait for our announcements. If we are going to extend this lockdown in our parish, na dahil, hindi dahil meron pong infection uh, si Father, but then on the other hand, this is to protect uh, ourselves, uh, one another, uh, from infecting each other. Uh, mahirap, mahirap ang magkasakit, mahirap ang makwarantine, nakakalungkot, at higit sa lahat, hindi po uh, cheap ang babayaran pag tayo po nagkasakit ng COVID-19. So once again, on behalf of our PPC, on behalf of our uh, CLPR, we beg for your understanding na hindi pa po natin binubuksan ang ating simbahan. So again, we pray that uh, God will really give us this gift of healing so that we can come back again and worship Him as a family, as a community. My dear friends, as a church today, we're celebrating the 25th Sunday in the Ordinary Time. At gustong gusto ko po yung mga pagbasa ngayon. Uh, but one of the things that I could say about the readings for today, particularly the gospel reading, uh, this is a continuation of the gospel reading from last weekend. Kung natapandan po ninyo yung gospel reading last Sunday, uh, it was the story wherein Jesus was asking his disciples, who do people say that I am? And of course, the disciples gave them the answers. But then Jesus asked them another question, and uh, he asked them, But who do you say that I am? And then Peter answered him uh, and told him that he is the Christ. And Jesus warned them not to tell this to anyone, but also he further on in his teachings, at ang sabi niya, Now that you believe, that you believe that I am the Christ, I am the Anointed One, and I am the Messiah, ito mangyayari sa akin, uh, people will ridicule me, and people will mock me, 
and he is going to uh, face suffering and rejection and he also would face the reality of death. Pero ang sabi niya, on the third day he will rise again. But then Peter didn't like, did not like what he heard from Jesus. So he grabbed the Lord at pinagsabihan ni Pedro si Jesus, never na ever nababanggitin mo ulit yan. Uh, kaya lang Jesus rebuked him. And what did Jesus tell Peter? Get behind me, Satan. Hindi mo na uunawaan ang iyong sinasabi. At ang iniisip mo ay hindi sa Diyos, kundi sa tao. And then in the gospel reading today, they continued on with their journey. Kaya lang habang naglalakbay at naglalakad, yung mga alagad nagkakwentuhan sa isa't isa. And then Jesus was asking them as to what they were talking about. Kaya lang walang sumasagot. And my dear friends, si Guro, ito lang po yung hunch, ito yung hula ni Father, uh, siguro natatakot sila na magsalita, baka yung isagot kasi ni Jesus hindi na naman nila magustuhan. Ano? But then on the other hand, the gospel reading itself tells us kung bakit ayaw nilang sagutin si Jesus. Dahil yung talagang pinag-uusapan nila ay para bang nakakahiya. After Jesus taught them that he had to suffer to save uh, people, ang pinag-uusapan ng mga alagad, para bang hindi konektado, at yung pinag-uusapan nila as, is this, sino yung pinakadakila sa kanila? Kaya nga po, alam ni Jesus naman talaga kung ano yung pinag-uusapan nila. So when they enter the house, ito kaagad yung sinabi ng Panginoon, makinig kayo, If anyone wishes to be first, sabi niya, then he shall be the last of all, the servant of all. My dear friends, actually the main theme of the readings for today, of the liturgy for today, is basically about service. And service is actually the call of every Christian. That is why we ask ourselves, ano yung mga takeaway na nandito sa ating liturgy ngayon. Well, una po sa lahat, I think the liturgy wants us to know that as Christians, that as followers of Christ, we need to take the role of a servant. Dahil sa katotohanan, pag ikaw, inamin mo na ikaw ay isang mananampalataya kay Jesus, if you claim to be a Christian, then service is always connected in your life. Dahil yan po ang buhay ng isang totoong kristyano. We can never end up in saying, I believe in Jesus, I profess that He is God. But without service, your faith can never ever be authentic. My dear friends, true faith in Jesus leads to service. Pagkatapos nating mapakinggan at akuin ang kanyang buhay, then our faith must lead us para sa paglilingkod sa ating kapwa. And that is the vocation of a Christian. Siguro ang pangalawang pwede nating matutunan sa ating liturgy at sa mga pagbasa ngayon is this, to really take time to serve. Dahil yung tawag sa pagiging isang Kristiyano, hindi lang kung kailan naisipan natin na pwede na tayong maglingkod. Kaya nga nakakalungkot kung minsan, even in my own family, even among my brothers and sisters, sometimes you could hear this reasoning. Pag ako nag-retire, maglelektor na ako. Pag ako nag-retire, ay ako y- Uubusin ko na ang panahon ko sa simbahan. My dear friends, I hope that should not be your reasoning. Dahil pag hindi tayo nag-living God and then claim that we are a believer in Christ, merong hindi tugma. Kaya nga, ang pag-living God, it must be a way of living for a Christian. Dahil Service is the very life of a Christian. That is why the second lesson 
that we can take from this liturgy we're celebrating today, take time to serve. Third, when we serve, be pure in your motives. Dahil kung minsan, uh, kadalasan talaga, uh, masarap na makitang naglilingkod. Masarap ang pakiramdam kung ikaw ay napupuna. Pero sana sa ating paglilingkod, hindi yun ang ating pakay. Ang pakay sa paglilingkod ay walang iba kundi ang pagmamahal sa Ama. And uh, recently, my dear brothers and sisters, you've been seeing me posting kung paano ko itinamiligay yung binibigay dito sa ating parokya. And sometimes, of course, I am grateful na sinasabi ninyo na ako yung dinadaluyan ng blessing mula sa Panginoon. Pero sa katotohanan, this is always my understanding. It's not me that the people, uh, rather, it's not me who is the reason why people are giving. Kung nagbibigay man sila, hindi kay Father Tito, hindi dahil sa mga mahihirap, basically, it's because they love the Lord. Dapat yan ang motibo. Dapat yan ang dahilan. Kaya nga kung nakikita niyo po sa mga post ninyo para sa akin, I never reply. Why? Because I know deep down, although sinasabi niyo, si Father Tito, mabait, pero I know deep down, you give and you serve because you love the Lord. That should be the motive. And my dear friends, the fourth lesson that we can take from the liturgy today is this. When you serve, it will certainly entail suffering and sacrifices. In the first reading today, that's exactly the message. Na pag ikaw ay maglingkod, abay magsasakripisyo. It will take your time. It will take an effort, and it will take a lot from you. But don't worry, because the lesson that is last in this liturgy is this. There is a reward in service. My dear friends, I challenge you, lose yourself in service. Because when you lose yourself in service, you will get to know yourself. And not only yourself, you will also get to know the true joy and happiness in life. Ito yung hindi nakuha ng mga alagad. Pero this is the invitation of Jesus. Lose yourself in service. Then you will know yourself. And you will know the true joy and happiness in life. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all things visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, light from light, true God from true God, begotten not made, consubstantial with the Father, through Him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation, He came down from heaven, and by the Holy Spirit was incarnate of the Virgin Mary, and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered death and was buried, and rose again on the third day in accordance with the Scriptures. 
he ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is adored and glorified, who has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins, and I look forward to the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. My dear friends, let us now voice our humble prayer to the Father, confident that we will receive His gracious care. For every petition we pray, Lord, make us humble of heart. Lord, make us humble of heart. May Pope Francis, Bishop, Priests, Deacons, religious men and women, forsake the trappings of titles and remain humble servants. We pray. Lord, make us humble of heart. May we honor all people, especially those who help us in our daily needs, rather than the gods of money, sport, fame, and politics. We pray. Lord, make us humble of heart. May we not prejudge anyone on account of color, race, gender, appearance, or disability. We pray. Lord, make us humble of heart. May we maintain our humility before the Lord as we face this pandemic through our faithful observance of health protocols to stem the tide of COVID-19 transmission. We pray. Lord, make us humble of heart. May all our brothers and sisters who passed away from this life be admitted to God's kingdom where peace and joy are surely found. We pray. Lord, make us humble of heart. Let us pray for the urgent concerns of our community and our personal intentions. We pray, Lord, make us humble of heart. Father, give us a humble heart that seeks to please not the world, but you alone. Show us your love in answer to our prayers, so that we may continue the mission of your kingdom, which you have entrusted to us, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Christ the gifts we bring to you, bounty of the earth receive on you. Take and bless the work of our hands. Christify these gifts at your command. Sun and moon and earth and wind and Contain in every grain all the toil and dreams of humankind. All we are, we bring as bread and wine. Pray, my brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. Let us pray. Receive with favor, O Lord, we pray, the offerings of your people, that what they profess with devotion and faith may be theirs to this heavenly mystery, through Christ our Lord. Amen. And the Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. 
It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you so loved the world that in your mercy you sent us the Redeemer to live like us in all things but sin, so that you might love in us what you love in your Son, by whose obedience we have been restored to those gifts of yours that by sinning we had lost in disobedience. And so, Lord, with all the angels and saints, we too give you thanks as in exaltation we acclaim. Holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness, make holy, therefore, this gift we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was tended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Save us, Savior of the world. Save us, Savior of the world. For by your cross and resurrection, you have set us free. We celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection. We offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Jesse, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her beloved spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints, 
who have pleased you throughout the ages. We may marry to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him and with Him and in Him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen, amen, amen. My dear friends, let us all together pray and sing the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. On earth as it is in heaven, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, He shall leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the face of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, to live and reign forever and ever. Amen. And the peace of the Lord be always with you. And with your spirit. Please suffer with one another some signs of God's peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. My brothers and sisters, behold Jesus. Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most suffering. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Let us pray. Graciously raise up, O Lord, those who renew with this sacrament, that we may come to possess your redemption, both in mystery and in the manner of our life, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please kneel and let us pray the prayer to St. Joseph. Hail, guardian of the Redeemer, spouse of the Blessed Virgin Mary. To you, God entrusted his only Son. In you, Mary placed her trust. With you, Christ became man. Blessed Joseph, to us too, show yourself a father and guide us in the path of life. Obtain for us grace, mercy, and courage and defend us from every evil. Amen. Short announcement. Due to the continuous rising of COVID cases in our community, our masses will continue to be live streamed. Our public masses remain suspended. On Monday, September 20, is the continuation of the Bible Timeline session at 7 p.m. Same meeting ID and passcode. Thank you. And the Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. My dear friends, go now in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Samare in omnibus servire 